Hi, I'm Dirk Bjornstad from Mercury Propellers, and today I'm going to talk to you about how to find the right pitch propeller for your boat. Well, one of the most common questions we get at Mercury Props is, am I running the right pitch on my boat? Well, first let's start with a quick discussion on what is pitch. Pitch basically refers to the angle of the blades. Now, if you're thinking about, for example, a screw moving through a piece of wood, pitch is, in theory, the amount of distance that a propeller would travel in one revolution if it was moving through a solid medium. So a 19 pitch, for example, would move farther, would move 19 inches, whereas a 15 pitch propeller would only move 15 inches. Generally, the higher pitch the propeller, generally the faster a boat is going to go. Um, but what's most important is that you find the correct, exact pitch that will be perfect for your boat. So I'm sure your first question is, well, how do I do that? Well, the first step you need is to take your existing boat, motor, and prop, take it out on the water, and run a few tests just to see where your current prop is operating from a wide open throttle RPM standpoint. To do that, we generally recommend topping off your boat with fuel, but keep it otherwise lightly loaded versus a typical outing on the water. Generally recommend warming up the boat for about five minutes, getting the engine in the right operating temperature, finding a wide open piece of uh, water where there's uh, not a lot of other boaters, give it full throttle, trim the engine up for speed, once you've maximized your speed, you want to record what your, uh, your wide open throttle RPM would be. Typically for an Optimax, you want that to be around 57 to 5800. For a Verado, you want that to be generally between 6000, 63, maybe even 6400. Most Verados we like to prop right to around 6200 RPM. So the question is, what happens if you've done a test, just like we talked about, and your RPMs are running outside of that range? Well. If uh, you're running a, an Optimax or Verado and you're basically running over the, the RPM range, your engine may even be beeping, which is a sign that you're uh, coming up against the rev limiter. What that means is you probably could handle a little bit more pitch on your propeller. In that case, probably what you'd want to do is add a one to two inches of pitch. And generally for each inch of pitch, you're going to be dropping RPM by about 150 to 200 RPM. A lot of our propellers come in two inch pitch increments. so. By moving up in pitch, you may be dropping your engine RPM as much as 400 RPM. Now on the reverse side, if your boat has a little bit too much prop on it, in that case, you'd probably want to move down one inch or two inches of, of pitch. And what that's going to do is that's going to increase RPM by about 150 to 200 RPM. So generally, these are just a few simple guidelines that'll help you have a productive discussion with your dealer and point you in the right direction to help you find the perfect pitch prop for your boat. I'm Dirk Bjornstad from Mercury Propellers. Thanks for watching.